Due to the imposed sanctions, not a single Russian team participates in the FIFA Women's World Cup 2023. But this does not mean that there are no hot female players in this country. Today, I will tell you about Ksenia Kovalenko, and at the end you will find out why the career of a football player could not have taken place at all. Ksenia Alexandrovna Kovalenko was born in 1995 in the small Kazakhstani town of Aksu, but did not live there for long, moving with her family to Novokuznetsk in early childhood. Kovalenko's sports path began there. At first, the girl was engaged in basketball and volleyball, in which her mother was strong, but in her free time she ran away to the football field with her older brothers with pleasure. And although the boys called her clumsy and constantly put her on the gate, her sister showed perseverance and a desire to learn. At the age of eight, Ksenia met her first coach, Svetlana Shalomova, literally on the street, and joined the local futsal section, where she began to make her first successes. When the girls' team coach went on maternity leave, Kovalenko didn't lose her head and started training with the boys again. There she crossed paths with the future midfielder of the Russian national team Alexander Golovin, who also took his first steps in football. After some time, the gifted girl was noticed and invited to play in the Kimarova Kuzbis, where she scored eight goals in one of the matches, setting a record for the first league, which has not yet been beaten. Then Ksenia played as an attacker, but over time she changed her role, becoming a defender. From the age of 16, Kovalenko began to be called up to the Russian youth team. Having started a professional sports biography in Kimarova, the girl then moved to Moscow, where she began to play for the Izmayovo CSP. In 2016, she became the champion of Russia for the first time as part of the Kimki Club Rasienka. A year later, this team merged with CSKA Moscow. With a new team in 2017, Kovalenko took the Russian Cup. In the same year, the football player distinguished herself at the national team level, bringing a bronze medal from the Universiade in Taipei. However, the athlete herself took this result as a defeat since she was going to the tournament for gold. Despite the interest from European and Turkish clubs, Ksenia is in no hurry to leave her native CSKA. In 2019, the club became the champion of Russia in women's football. Kovalenko then temporarily suspended work as she underwent spinal surgery in October. She had a long recovery and rehabilitation phase ahead of her, and she could not help the team until the end of the season. And then pregnancy and childbirth did not allow me to return to sports, but more on that later. The men's magazine FHM in 2014 included Ksenia in the 100 of the sexiest girls on the planet. At the same time, an attractive and desirable football player carefully guards the space of her personal life. For the amusement of the public, the athlete posted on Instagram a picture with Jaeger Creed, whom she poured milk on the football field in July 2019 after he lost a sports bet to her. Most often, Kovalenko posts shots from the field and his own portraits in his account. Photos in a swimsuit also appear there, which demonstrate the slender figure of a football player with a height of 173 centimeters, she weighs 61 kilograms. The girl takes her own beauty calmly, without making a fetish out of it, but without makeup she tries not to get into the camera lens. External data allow Ksenia to enter into profitable advertising contracts, which often exceed her football salary. In July 2020, Information appeared about the beauty's romance with Denis Glushikov. For the new year 2021, Ksenia published a picture with a football player and wished everyone to love and take care of each other. And in March, Denis posted a photo with a newborn child on his account and said that Kovalenko gave him a daughter, Mila. A little later it became known that the lovers got married when Ksenia was pregnant. The parents tried to share the care of the newborn. In an interview, the happy father said, when he needed to train the next day, Ksenia herself got up at night to Mila. And sometimes the wife asked him to help if she was very tired. Then the night post was for Dennis. Going on maternity leave, like other athletes, Kovalenko was worried that her football career would end there. 
but the coach reassured her with words about the mandatory return to the team. By the way, Xenia did not stop training until the 38th week of pregnancy. And after being discharged from the hospital, she began to include feasible loads in her daily routine. At the end of the summer, the athlete was already working with colleagues from CSKA in team training and even held her 50th match in her career. Kovalenko's plans were to gain a foothold in the first team and, of course, further victories. But the career of a football player could not take place at all. At the age of 14, Ksenia represented the Siberian national team at one of the tournaments when she received a severe ankle injury. She had to undergo several difficult operations, but Kovalenko did not quit the sport and achieved good success, becoming an idol for many aspiring football players. Do not forget to write comments, put likes and subscribe to the channel, they talk about sports here.